Hey guys, what's up? This is Chris Steves with eXp Realty in Ottawa, and I'm going to talk to you about how realtors will get you the most money on the sale of your home. And kind of in particular, talking about the realtor selling process, listing process versus an online auction process. Um, so the main difference is one is a closed bid process versus the other is an open bid process. Closed bid meaning that the buyers don't know what the other bidders are offering. They don't get to see what the other offers are on a property. And in the online auction, the buyers do get to see what the other bids are and they get to act accordingly. So when I'm dealing with sellers, you know, after many, many years of this, almost always, I would say pretty much every time their priority is getting the most money they can for the sale of their house or condo. Uh, and so that's where we use this closed bid process for a reason. It's very well thought out. It's very effective. And we will say, okay, we're going to prep the home, get it all ready to list. And we list that house and we say, okay, we're not going to accept any offers until next week, you know, usually seven or eight days later and gives everybody a chance to see the home and, you know, get prepped and ready to make an offer. And then on offer day, you get multiple offers. And, uh, and just probably the best way is to, if I use an example so you can see the power of this process. So I listed a detached house in the West End of Ottawa last year for 690000 We had six offers on it. Five of those offers were between the range of seven hundred and twenty and seven hundred and sixty thousand, but there was one buyer that clearly loved this home and they had to have it, and they came in with their offer. It was eight hundred and sixty three thousand. They are a hundred and three thousand above the next highest offer. Right, they were 863 was the highest, 760 was the next highest, and so on. And that's the power of the closed bid process. In an in an open bid, what's going to happen? You're going to get the aggressive buyer coming in. They're they're at the bids are at 760 thousand, and then you've got the guy that that wants to outbid them. Well, he's going to go to 762 thousand. 763 you know he's just gonna inch above the next highest offer and you just don't get that potential for this hitting it out of the park home run where you know this buyer goes a hundred thousand above the next guy uh, and so that's where I've found that this closed bid uh, process through a good realtor they're able to get a lot more money on the sale of the home uh, this happened to me a couple weeks ago at a town home in the East End, and we had 13 offers on it. And most of those offers were, you know, between kind of 670 to 700,000. And then we had the one buyer that obviously had to have this home, and they came in at 742,000. They're 42,000 dollars higher than the next highest offer and and that just goes to show like this is very common it's happened with my listings many many times and that is you know just a very easy example where you can see um, this closed bid approach allows this opportunity for such a home run where you get a buyer that's willing to just go way above and beyond and uh, I haven't well, I don't believe that works in the online auction because, you know, they're only going to go up in these tiny little increments and, and they're going to beat out the next offer by a couple grand instead of a hundred grand. Um, so also something else that I, that I've noticed with realtors and how we list homes is, you know, the potential of a bully offer or preemptive offer. So, I've seen many listings come out and I've had them myself 
where you know we say okay no offers till next week uh, we're trying to get our bidding war but somebody a buyer an aggressive buyer comes in within one or two days of listing the property and they come in with an offer of two hundred or three hundred thousand dollars above asking price and that's you know we call that a bully offer and you as the buyer has that have the opportunity to say yeah you know what absolutely that's an insanely high offer and you take it and run you know and so uh, that is just another scenario where using this realtor approach you know you can hit this like crazy home run that just blow you know blows everything out of the water and and you end up getting way more than you thought you possibly could for your home sale and I don't think I believe that you you just don't get that with the online auction, you know, in that process, and especially when you can, you know, everybody can see what the other bids are. Um, so, you know, that's really kind of it in a nutshell. Uh, obviously, there's tons of other details surrounding this whole process of using a realtor or doing an online auction or trying to sell yourself for sale by owner. You know, there, there are a number of ways to sell a home, but after a lot of analysis, I've found that the absolute best way is the realtor approach with closed bids in the multiple offers. And uh, it, it turns into a home run almost every time. So yeah, that's really it. If you guys have questions about any of that, I'm happy to chat about it, happy to answer any questions you have. You can find my info on the links on the video. Uh, chrissteves.ca always happy to have a conversation and uh, i hope that the video was enlightening and helpful all right